Welcome to Quicking. In this video, we will get familiar with the Quicking dashboard menus, learn to configure our Quicking account settings, overview of Quicking dashboard, open your browser, enter quicking.com. In the top right corner of the website, click on login and enter your email address and password to access our Quicking dashboard. Now, you can see our Quicking dashboard. Here we have several menus. New order help you to create an order easily. Orders you will find several options for creating and managing your orders. The next menu is for products offering multiple options to create and push products to your store. In the design menu you can add and manage your designs. The next option returns makes handling written easy for you. Accounts provide you with all account related information. The integration menu displays our integration options. Use add many options to prepay for your orders. The bell icon lets you know about the updates from Quicking. Settings to manage your account settings. Learn to configure your account settings. Click settings. Profile. In the personal information, all the fields are filled out automatically. If you want, you can edit it. Then business information. Enter the business name, brand name and WhatsApp number is there. And fill out the mandatory fields, country, address, city, state and PIN code. Enter your GST number for invoices. Providing GST is optional. Lastly, enter your website name. Click Summit. Next tab is Shipping. Brand sticker. Upload your brand logo here in the mention size for free to promote your brand. This logo will be printed on the invoice label of the package. Check the box to pack all your orders in boxes. Next, Company logo. Upload your brand logo here to display it on the tracking page. Courier Priorities Choose your preferred courier service. The system automatically selects the second priority carrier if the first carrier is unavailable. Click Summit. Next, Exclude Couriers. Select your Exclude Courier Preferences. Then click Summit to update your details. Sometimes the system can't book orders with the preferred couriers because the shipping partner's API is down. Next, bank details. Enter your bank account name, bank account number, re-enter the bank account number for verification. Then enter the bank IFSC code. Then click OTP. Enter the OTP from your mail and click verify then you will see a verification completed message. Then click save bank details. Next option is updates. By enabling automatic process prepaid store orders to send your prepaid store orders directly to all orders instead of the on hold page. Ensure you prepay for these orders otherwise they will remain on the on hold page. Next you will see two radio buttons. Add COD remittance to valid. Add COD remittance to my bank account. Selecting either option allow you to remit your COD remittance as you prefer. Check the boxes for email and WhatsApp preferences. Thank you.